Professor Johnson checking in. I hope you're enjoying a great weekend. Since this is our first major homework weekend, I'm here to remind you of what's due and give you some suggestions for mastering the material. We are working on foundational concepts that will help determine your success or failure in this course. Invest the time now to master them. So let's get started. Complete the homework for Chapter 2. Let's go over a few important reminders. You should have printed the homework out in Connect. You should have completed all of the exercises and problems by hand and from scratch on a blank piece of paper. Then you should have taken the solutions from your work and entered them into Connect. Connect should serve as an accuracy checker. Here's a few reminders about the homework. There are unlimited Check My Work clicks. Use it as often as you feel you need to. Some students have told me that some teachers limit this feature. I do not. Remember that you can attempt the homework as many times as you want prior to midnight on Sunday night. Don't forget to submit it. Most importantly, keep a binder of your homework solutions. You will find this to be an invaluable tool when studying for your exams. Keep it neat and organized. Next, complete the quiz for Chapter 2. Remember that you are only allowed one attempt. A timer will run for 60 minutes. Ensure you have adequate time and a reliable internet connection. You might even post a sign that says, do not disturb. After the due date, you can see what you missed. Go to the results tab of Connect and review the questions you missed so that you don't repeat the same mistakes on the exam. If time permits, start the optional Learn Smart assignment which has shown to significantly improve test scores. The link looks like this and can be found in your Connect site. Look for the black LS logo on the far right hand side. You have to study as you go. You have to practice the material several times during the week. The Learn Smart module is a great way to reinforce the material you just learned. I highly recommend it. When Chapter 2 is completed, keep going. Read Chapter 3. The basic focus of the chapter is on T accounts and the rules of debits and credits. Use a highlighter pen and take notes. Consider outlining it. This chapter can be a little challenging. If your class has had the first lecture on Chapter 3, then try half the homework. If you have not yet had a lecture on Chapter 3, then you may want to try the first few exercises. Practice, practice, and practice again. If you do these things, you will be well prepared for class, and the lecture will be much more meaningful. Again, compile these materials in a notebook. This study notebook, which should now have an outline, class notes and handouts, and homework solutions for each chapter will be invaluable to you when you study for the exam. It is imperative that you remain organized. So to sum it all up, here is a recap of what you should focus on this weekend. Your homework is due for Chapter 2 by Sunday night. Your quiz is due for Chapter 2 by Sunday night. You should have spent significant time studying Chapter 2. You should read Chapter 3 on T accounts and the use of debits and credits and attempt the homework, at least a few problems. We will finish up Chapter 3 next week. Remember, your first and most important test is just around the corner. Time management is critical. Build in the study hours this weekend. I am enjoying this class. I hope you are too.
I care about you and your academic success. I believe we are well on our way to understanding the basics of the accounting cycle for a small service company. Chapters two and three are the most important chapters of the entire semester. Invest the time in them. In the words of the famous college coach, the late John Wooden, nothing will work unless you do. Let's start off on a positive note this semester. If you need help, please reach out. Remember, there are also instructional labs and tutorial services available. The days and times are listed on the front page of my website. I'm going to sign off. I'm loving the journey. See you next week.